Hello guys, welcome to Pelcam. I am making this video to show you what it takes to make a Pelcam container and we we'll start off with a view of the shop. Here is the machine, it's a has machine, a CNC BF4. We have here the bench, uh, we have the computer, we have the toolbox. As you can see, there's even a picture of my beautiful daughter. If you guys want to know, I have a daughter. Um, here are the shelves of the shop. You can see we have here a little bit of pros that I have a stock up for Christmas and you guys know you gotta help me out by buying my products so I can keep making them and you can buy them and you can show them to your friends and see what it takes to make American made products. Okay, let's start out. Here we have the metal which is aluminum 6061. It's been cut out from a bar and it is a Let's see, it's cut out in four inches. We're gonna make Pelcan 3.9. So that's what you see here. And here we have the tool holder that has some of my tools. But more important, we have the tumbler over there. Okay, so well let's start out. When we make a Pelcan container, we have to follow a few steps. One of them is setting up the tools and we have to make sure that we follow pretty rigorous steps. At least that's my style, guys. It's CNC style machining, so I follow my own, my own lead. I've been machining for 20 years, so I'm gonna show you what I do. I hope you like, you, you, I hope you guys like it. And I'm gonna start out by showing you how I touch the tools up, how I dial in the parts, and the setup in general um, and here is a overview of devices that it takes to make a Vulcan container thank you